oh how I do love some plant growth regulator. In this video, we're gonna share an application technique that's gonna allow you to get all the benefits of using Primo Max in your lawn with none of the negatives. Now the reason why you'd wanna consider using plant growth regulator in your lawn care program, like why it's super awesome, is you get a deeper green color to your lawn, less frequent mowing requirements, and in general, you get a more hardier stand of turf that resists disease and drought conditions better than a lawn that is not regularly treated with Primo Max. Like most things in life though, not all sunshine and roses. One of the big concerns that people have with using a product like this in their lawn is that you get that dreaded tip burn or temporary bronzing to the lawn, especially the first time when you apply it in the season. So to get around that, I've been bouncing some ideas off some friends of mine that work in the golf course industry, as well as doing some research on my own, and what I came up with is the idea of instead of applying Primo Max once per month, which gives you three to four weeks of regulation, applying it every two weeks at half the rate to see if you can still get all the benefits, green color, less mowing, better disease and drought resistance, while not getting that tip burn. So I tested it on my lawn for the past couple of months, as well as a couple other lawns in the neighborhood, and here are the results. I got the exact same regulation, same color, same uh, reduced mowing requirements, and the lawn looks as good as it's ever looked, but not once this season on my lawn or any of the other lawns that get varying degrees of, of applications of other products did I see any tip burn whatsoever. So what that means is like, let's say the normal application rate for Primo Max for your particular grass type, we'll use Bermuda and Zoysia because that's what I'm really familiar with, is a quarter of an ounce per thousand square feet when mixed with a gallon of water. So what that means is that if you had a four gallon backpack spirit, which I just happen to conveniently have here, is that you would mix one fluid ounce of Primo Max with four gallons of water, and that would cover you for three to four weeks. That is the full rate. That is the rate that is spelled out on the label. What you're gonna use doing this technique that I recommend is that you're gonna go at half of that. So you're gonna go out at half or 0.5 fluid ounces mixed with the same four gallons of water to cover the same 4,000 square feet. And what you're gonna find is that you're gonna get the same regulation, no tip burn, like really there's no negatives to doing this, other than you have to get out there every couple of weeks and spray it. And that's really probably the only consideration that you'd have to make whether or not you'd wanna go this route or not. If you're someone like me that does a spoon feeding program where I fertilize my lawn on the first of the month and then again on the 15th of the month, this is really a no brainer. I'm already out there anyway, spraying fertilizer, my biosimilants, all the various accoutrements to give my lawn the best possible color. So it takes no time at all to add, you know, half an ounce of Primo Max to the tank of what I'm already spraying on the lawn and get it done. But if you're someone that one, doesn't like to get out in the lawn very often, or you just don't have the time to do it, sticking with that full rate once per month will probably be the technique that you actually end up with. But I can tell you that I've been using this for the past couple of months and there's no way I'm going back. I absolutely love the results I'm getting. There's not been any real flush of growth or anything crazy happening with the lawn. It's just been, again, literally like I said in the outset, all the benefits with none of the negatives. Now, if you're also interested in learning about what else I mix along with Primo Max to get the best possible lawn, I've got a video right here for you to watch next. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.